New York and Los Angeles. As a preacher as well as a politician, you know that presidents need the moral authority to bring the entire country together. The leading Republican candidate, when you look at the average of national polls right now, is Donald Trump. When you look at him, do you see someone with the moral authority to unite the country? There's a few questions I've got. The last one I need is to give him some more time. I love Donald Trump. He's a good man. I'm wearing a Trump tie tonight. Get over that one. Okay? question, but thank you, Governor. You're welcome. <laughs> Let me tell you, Donald Trump would be a better president every day of the week and twice on Sunday rather than Hillary. I've spent a lifetime in politics fighting the Clinton machine. You want to talk about what we're going to be up against next year? I'm the only guy on this stage. You know, everybody has an only guy. I'm the only guy this. I'm the only guy that. Let me tell you one thing that I am the only guy. The only guy that has consistently fought the Clinton machine every election I was ever in over the past 26 years. And not only did I fight them, but I beat them. Somebody says I'm a fighter. Well, I want to know, did you win? Well, I did. And not only did I fight them and win, I lived to tell about it. And I'm standing on this stage tonight as evidence of that. And I think that ought to be worth something. Thank you, Governor. John, John, I'll tell you something. You want to talk about moral authority. Um, let's talk about...